Hi, welcome to automationtesting.in. In this video, we'll see install Java in Mac machine. For this, first we'll check whether Java is installed in our machine or not. For this, go to the system preferences, go to the left top corner, Apple symbol and click on system preferences. One, in the system preferences, in the down section, you can find Java if it is installed in this section. How you see Flash Player, MySQL, NTFS for Mac. The same way you can find Java in this place. Now we are not seeing any Java so that is not installed in our machine. And the second way is go to the terminal and type Java space hyphen version. Then you can see no java runtime present requesting install and you will find one of the pop-ups called to use the java command line tool you need to install a jdk click more info to visit the java developer kit download website now i'll click on more info then it navigated to oracle.com slash java downloads page here we can see latest java ac 10 but I am not very sure how it is stable or not. I will search for Java 8. Okay, for this, go to the Google and search download Java JDK 8 and go to the Java SC Developer Kit 8 and you can see that. Java SE Development Kit 8 downloads. Here you can see that this kind of section. To download Java, you need to accept license agreement. You will find one of the radio buttons. You just accept the license agreement and then you search for which is compatible for your machine. Here you can see Linux, Windows, Solaris and the same way you can find Mac OS and it is 247.12 MB and the extension of this file is .dmg just click on this now it started downloading it takes bit time depends upon your internet speed okay, wait till it downloads it got downloaded now I'll just click on that now you can find this pop up that opening jdk and dot dmg file you will find this this kind of pop up now it says double click on the icon to install and double click and you can find some other pop up install jdk 8 update 161 it depends upon your version and then just click on continue and it will tell you standard install on Macintosh HD this will take 581.7 MB of space on your computer it should be available and then click install it will ask you for the system password give the password and click on install software now it is installing install time remaining about a minute it will take bit time to download or install you see that the installation was completed successfully and then close and then if you want to move the jdk8 update 161 install it to the trash that is your wish you can move to the trash or you can keep i'll move to the trash and you can close this one also now java is installed in our machine but before that we need to set environment variable for the system then how you can set environment variable for that go to the terminal and just type dollar java underscore home it should be capital then hit enter then you will not find anything simply executed and you can see the same command prompt it is not giving 
any extra information okay if it is there then it will give you the path of where java is installed so it is not giving that information means it is not recognizing so now we need to set the environment variable means machine can understand or know that where java exactly installed or available in the machine so you need to make the machine to understand or know where the java is so for that what you need to do you just type ls space hyphen al hit enter then you will find hint some hidden files called hidden files will be started with dot okay so in this you need to find one of the files called dot bash profile dot bash underscore profile this is the one if it is not there in your machine you need to do one thing that you need to create how you will create touch dot bash underscore profile when you hit enter it will create dot bash underscore profile as it is already there in my machine I am not executing this otherwise you just execute now what you need to do open the dot bash profile for that you need to run the command open space hyphen e then dot bash underscore profile and hit enter then you can see this kind of file and I have some information inside this along with this I need to put some extra information that is I will copy and paste you can put wherever you want and it should be small export java underscore home is equal to dollar inside the brackets you need to mention slash usr slash lib exec slash java underscore home and then save the file Okay, go to the file and save and close okay now you set the environment variable for java and close the existing terminal and open a fresh terminal and here you just type the same way dollar java underscore home and hit enter now you can see that hyphen bash and wherever java is library slash java slash java virtual machine slash jdk 1.8.0 underscore 161 dot jdk it will give you this kind of information means you set environment variable and along with that we will verify that version of java java space hyphen version you see that java version 1.8.0 underscore 161 and then we will verify in the system preferences okay go to the system preferences i think you need to close this one go to the system preferences now you can see java here okay means java is successfully installed in our machine thank you for watching this video please like us on a facebook page and don't forget to subscribe to YouTube channel for further updates.